Welcome to Arson Girl Plays. Please subscribe and ring the bell. That way you won't miss out on my next video. Hey guys, welcome back to Arson Girl Plays. I am back in Overlook Bay today and I am going to take you into Santa's workshop and we're going to check out all of the cookie games. Are you guys ready? Let's go in and get started. For the big Christmas update in Overlook Bay, cookies are our main currency. So we're gonna wanna earn a lot of cookies. And there are three ways to do it in Santa's workshop. One of them is this mini game where you have to sort coal and presents. And if you do it really well, you're gonna earn some seriously good prizes. And I'm gonna show you how to do it. And then we're going to move on and check out some of the other games. So I just talked to the elf, said I wanted to work this job. I have three and a half minutes to sort as many presents and coal as possible. So we're gonna do it really fast. I'm gonna speed it up so you guys don't have to watch three and a half minutes of it. But basically you just wanna grab a present, put it on this ledge. You wanna grab it, keep going, keep going, keep going. And then if you get coal, you put it over here so it goes in the coal bag. You don't want any coal to go in the present bag. You don't want any presents to go in the coal bag. And the better you do, the more cookies you get. It's pretty easy but it does take a lot of concentration. So you're definitely gonna to wanna to pay attention, get your camera in the right place so that you can just stand still and grab and flip. So as you can see, that's what I'm doing here. I'm just grabbing the presents as they go by. And look at that, I got 80 cookies because I scored 187 points. So that was an easy 80 cookies in three minutes. I mean, you can't beat it. Now let's go check out some of the other games that you can do in here. And I will at the end tell you what my favorite one is next game is all about wrapping presents so talk to the elf start the game and you come in here you're gonna see these little images so there's a present you have to get you have to color it the right color and then you have to wrap it in the right wrapping paper so you can see behind me I have the presents you just grab the present that you need. So I'm gonna grab the little car, then I'm gonna come over here and I'm gonna paint it yellow, and then I'm gonna come over here and I'm gonna grab the package. Now, the fact that I walked around and did it, I only did that for this to show you how the steps are. Because once you put on the conveyor belt, you're basically sending it off to Santa's workshop. I learned through the course of playing this game that there is a proper place to stand where you can just flip around, grab everything, and throw it on the conveyor belt. So don't move around. The less you move around, Around, the more time you'll have to collect the presents the higher your score will get so you can see right here where I just start standing still it's because I figured out my sweet spot you just have to figure out your sweet spot once you do you will just flip those presents on that conveyor belt so fast Santa's workshop will not know what hit it there will be presents just flying down that conveyor belt I don't think they can load them on the sleigh fast enough so just find your sweet spot start flipping those presents around and when you're done here you go you get some cookies and then you go on to the next game which leads us to the final game in the workshop let's go check it out the final game is in the bakery downstairs so you're gonna go in here talk to the elf start the job and you're gonna fill cookie orders here is my number one tip make sure you cook the cookies because the first time I played this I didn't cook the cookies and I got a big old fat zero cookies for my reward so it was really ugly really bad so just make sure you cook the cookies and just like the other game you're gonna want to figure out the sweet spot to stand so that you can see the oven the cookies the icing the sprinkles and the picture of the orders so as you can see while I play around in here I'm trying to figure out my camera because you don't really need to see the oven what you need to see is where that orange bar is you need to see it turn green because once it's green that's when you want to grab your cookie out of the oven if it goes past green then your cookie is going to be overcooked so you want to make sure you grab it as fast as you can okay all of the cooking oven stuff out of the way I want to talk about what you do with this game of all the games this one has the most steps so basically you grab a cookie you ice it you sprinkle it, you cook it, and you do it according to the order board. So it'll tell you what cookie you need, what color icing, what color sprinkles, and then you put it on this little white disc and it serves it up to the customer who wants it. Now, the trick that I found out that works best for me, actually, I don't think I show it to you here in this video, but I do it this way. I get the cookie, I ice the cookie, I sprinkle the cookie, then I cook the cookie, and then I deliver the cookie. I In this video, I do it the other way. I grab the cookie, cook the cookie, 
ice the cookie, sprinkle the cookie. Oh my gosh, say that 15 times fast. Anyway, and then deliver it. But I found out that I can do it a lot faster if I do it the other direction. So I put the fully decorated cookie in the oven, then serve it up. And again, just like the other games, you just find your sweet spot. This is my sweet spot so I can see everything. I can kind of work it all around as fast as possible. I can serve up the cookies and then look at that, 80 cookies. I am definitely on a mission to get a perfect score on all these games right now. I'm kind of falling somewhere in the middle to the upper end, uh, but I'm going to keep working on it because I like how fast I can get cookies doing these games and I highly recommend it if you want to get your cookie levels up really fast. You're going to want to come to Santa's workshop and work these jobs. Now at the time of the filming of this video, they were seven minute cooldowns. I believe I was told that that has now changed to five minutes, so it should be a little bit faster for you to do the jobs and hopefully uh, you guys will just rake in the cookies as fast as possible. I hope all these tips helped you guys. If they did, please give me a thumbs up. Let me know you watched. And of course, if you're new to my channel and you want to see more, make sure you smash that subscribe button, ring the bell, and let YouTube know that you want to know when I post something new on the channel because you don't want to miss out. I have lots more Overlook Bay coming as well as some other fun Roblox games. And I really hope you'll be here for all of it. Until next time, you guys. Bye.